Yes, I am Mr. Burke. And you? What? Well, you are not a resident of this putrescent... Is he a human cesspool. trafficker? That makes you a rather valuable individual. If you've got a point, make it. As you wish. I'm looking to employ an individual with no ties to Megaton. No interest in its future. Why? Megaton is obsolete. Why, though? The last vestige of a cobbled, desperate past. It needs to go away. And you are going to see that it does. So with the nuke, you want me to use the nuke? No, no. I'm merely a recruiter. You Why, have though? the real fun. The undetonated atomic bomb for which this town is named is still very much alive. All it needs is a little motivation. I have in my possession a fusion pulse charge. Once rigged to the bomb, it will be detonated by you at a secure location. Easy money, my friend. Huh. I have a proposition of my own. Would you like to hear it, Mr. Burke? Yeah, let's use our Black Widow. Color me intrigued. Go on. Hmm. 500, you say? Well, um... um Yes. Yes, I think that can be arranged. I must admit, I find you enchanting. We're not going to do it. Uh, do this for me, and there's no telling how far my gratitude will reach. Take the fusion pulse charge, place it into the bomb, and meet me at Tenpenny Tower. There I will show you what true power is. I told you, Gob, it ain't the radio. I don't recognize He's you. really loud. I think everybody heard him. Something? I hope by something to do, you mean a job. Otherwise, you want to talk with Nova. I'm looking for someone to make a delivery. Interested? Yeah, sure. Why not? Great. I'd like you to deliver this message to my family in the Aravu settlement. I yeah, family up? Them in months, and I'm worried. Not good. As soon as you get there... Talk to Davis West. He'll be glad to pay you for the trip. Can you give me some sure. information? Be glad to, since you're doing me a big favor and all. Where is Arfu? Arfu is northwest of Megaton, on an old overpass over the Potomac. If you follow what's left of the river, you can't miss it. Do you suspect your family's in danger? Or is there anything dangerous around there I should know about? What? Apart from the wasteland critters, labor raiding parties, raider hit squads, probably and a dumb question. Landline? Yeah, I get it. No, it's completely yeah, safe. Yeah, sorry. If this was easy, I'd go myself, you know. The Enclave station comes in fine. No, Galaxy News. Their signal's been shit lately. Hi there. I'm Nova. New to Megaton, huh? Do yourself a favor and keep walking. Some of us stay for a few days. And then it's five years later. Yeah, I remember that man. I saw him talking to Moriarty. What? Hard to forget handsome men like that. Yeah, I'll help you. Then Moriarty kicks my sweet ass out the door. How so? Sorry, kid. If you want to know more... Moriarty is the only one who's gonna help you. Talk to Gob. He hates Moriarty more than I do. Maybe he'll tell you something, but I doubt it. Fair enough. Work. Come on, work. Cut it out. Is that... Hey, smooth skin. You need something? A drink, maybe? Anything? Anything at all? Let me think about it for a moment, my good man. Wait, you're not going to hit me, yell at me, 
Not even berate me a little bit. I hadn't planned on it. Well, now, that's a surprise. I'm used to every asshole smooth skin in this town giving me shit just because I look like a corpse. I'm glad to see that there are a few worthwhile people around here. Listen, Moriarty'd have my head if he caught me selling at a discount. But for you, I'll risk it. Ah. Looking for my father, middle-aged guy. Maybe you've seen him. Oh, yeah. I do remember a guy like that. Shout out, Honestly, Gob. I usually keep my head down. I tend to get smacked around if I look customers in the eyes. But talk to Moriarty, he'll know more. Speech. Speech. Let's roll it. I was like you once. I wandered into town looking for an escape from this stupid joke of a body I'm trapped in. Now look at me. Very well. Moriarty keeps the computer terminal in the back. On it, he keeps all the going go. to Megaton. If you can get onto that terminal, I'll bet he has information on your dad. Now get away from me, smooth skin. If Moriarty even suspects I told you this, I'm a dead ghoul. You stuck your neck out. Got a problem? Looking screen. Let's cost you. Should we take it? Hold up, we save. Save, new save. Nothing happened. Colin Moriarty, at your service. Welcome to Moriarty. <laughs> my saloon, my home, my slice of heaven in this backwoods little burg. If you've got the caps, I've got your pleasure. Please sit down, make yourself comfortable. Your troubles are a thing of the past. Okay. Looking for my father. God, it's you. The little baby girl all grown up. Persistent little flower, ain't you? Then and now it would seem. It's been a long time, kid. Oh, your daddy passed through here all right. Here and gone. Got what he came for and then left. I'm assuming you'll do the same, correct? Um. My father and I were born in Vault 101. You're lying. The vault's been sealed for 200 years. Oh, my father and I were born in Vault 101. Is that what your father told you? That you were born in that hole? That he was born there as well? Oh, the lies we tell to those we love. Your father brought you to the vault right after you were born. To keep you safe, you see. I remember it well. You stayed in my saloon, after all. That's right. Your father, his brotherhood of steel friend, and you, the suckling babe with nary a tit to suckle. Sorry about your mom, truly. Ah, but life goes on. Daddy lied. Life's full of little disappointments. And now you're all grown up and wondering where he's gone to. Pretty much. I knew where I grew up. I literally played through it, so. I knew where I grew up. Ah, I see. You know, I heard about the brainwashing that goes on down there. From some other fella, escaped, oh, five years back. All hail the overseer, we're born in the vault, we die in the vault, and all that other assorted lunacy. Wait. Kid, you've got better programming than our own Deputy Weld. You'd best wise up quick. Wouldn't want anyone taking advantage of you, hmm? No, what? I was kidding, Dad talked about you all the time. Now, really, where is he? Speech 51, let's roll it. Did he? Boom! Our time together was brief, but that is the way of it, I feel. When a bond is forged, little else matters, hmm? Well, he did come through here, but he left. I'm truly sorry. Yeah. But, but maybe you can catch up to him. He headed southeast into the city. Said he needed That's information needed. from those loonies at the station. You know, Galaxy News Radio. What there is of it. What's all about Galaxy it? Galaxy News Radio is some loudmouth radio station located in the ruins of D.C. 
Three dog. The king of that loony bin keeps yapping about fighting some good yapping? fight or something. A bunch of crap. But I suppose if you wanted to know what was going on in the wasteland, that's the place to go. Me, I could care less. And so now. Okay. I'm gone. Hell of a day, isn't it? Oh my god. The GNR building plaza. Follow his footsteps. Blood ties. I did want to go see the uh, the signal. Where was that coming from? It's coming south in that area. Let's look at the other one. Out of this world. Oh my god, that's really far north. But Arfu's up there. We could messenger up that way, hit Arfu, hit here, go back to dad, hit back here. Because I bet it's going to make us go back to Lucy. Hey there, glad you're back. Okay. That seems awesome. This has got a lot of promise. This is already really cool. I really like this. If you guys are liking it and you enjoy watching this, I appreciate having you around and just being here. And if anyone is out there that's played a bit of Fallout, drop the lore. Drop whatever you want to drop because I honestly know nothing. This is a first time playthrough. Um, I'm hoping to turn this into a video like after we get done streaming it and everything and talk about it a bit more. But so far, like the initial quest line, it feels like your traditional opener Bethesda, but it's got some spice to it. Like it's got a bit more than I was expecting, and that's a good thing. Um, it surprised me in a way that's fun, and it pulled me in in a sense that old video games used to do all the time. And it, it really makes me happy that there's still games out there that you can like pick up and play that are this old. And this isn't even an old game. It's like 2006 or something. But it amazes me that there's still games that you could just grab, you know, from like back then, never having played it. And it can surpass your expectations for what most modern things are. So, I don't know. I think it's super sick. I think it's really cool. And I kind of don't want to stop playing it right now. I want to end the stream for a second so I can go like eat but a part of me is like what? No, no you you should keep going for just a little bit more the men, women, and children of the earth should we save it and blow it up to gather and behold the power I don't want to Let those but you can just activate it right there you could touch the tip of it and just activate it. Come forth and drink the waters of the glow. For this ancient weapon of war is our salvation. It is the very symbol of Atom's glory. Sure. I like your two-headed cow. Is this the door? It is! Oh. Some scrub. Try the brass lantern. Brass lantern? Got it. Got it. Got it. Also, yes, we're headed the right way. Straight ahead. Oh, I'm a wanderer. I roam around, 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 around. Whoa. A Hope you enjoyed that courtesy of uh, One Dog Radio. Lockbox Radio. Should just keep heading forward. This looks better than uh, Fallout 76. 
graphically. I mean, it does and it doesn't, you know what I mean? Like, the lighting and atmosphere in this one is better than 76. The foliage looks better than 76. <laughs> what the fuck? Hey. 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 Wait a second there, buddy. I don't think you know you're messing with the, the oh, oh, oh no. I see they got melee weapons, huh? I'm gonna play it that way. Bring it on, pal. Bring it on. Ow, fuck. Ow, somebody has a gun, ow. Bam. 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 One more hit. Keep shooting your boy. Keep shooting your boy. Mid swing. Hit the stimmy. Let's put on the security armor. Pistol. With the big iron on his hip. The big iron on his hip. To the town of all freedom, motor strange. Oh. Sorry about your eye. Oh, sorry about your head. Chinese pistol? Knife? Sick. That's awesome. Value of 20 on his outfit as well. Can we take it? Oh, thank you. Just took me a second. I didn't know there was a third person in this as well. What do we got here? Oh! Hey! Ah! I'm sorry, doggy. Uh, oh! We're gonna have to sidestep as soon as I click this. Ah! Dog meat. I don't want to eat dog meat. Head wrap. John's key. Medex. What's the notes say? Can we read that? Guess not. Oh, notes tab. Okay. Billy, I'm sorry I stole it. You deserve to have it back. Remember the scrapyard north of the Bethesda? Did they just put their own name in the game? Remember the old scrapyard north of the Bethesda ruins? Look in the burned out bus in the northwest corner near an old red box car. Tell Laureen I'm sorry. I still love her and I'm sorry for everything. I hope someday, or I hope somebody finds this before the buzzards tear it to pieces. Your loving brother, John. Tell Laureen I still love her. Hope somebody finds this before the buzzards tear it apart. You're an old red box car. Okay. Greetings from Point Lookout, straight from the land of the warm beaches and luscious wetlands, uh, comes the Dush's Gambit. The finest vessel on the East Coast, piloted by Tober the Ferryman, and to the hungry masses of the capital wasteland, he brings the hardy punga fruit, a delicious, nutritious and addition to your daily meal, and its tangy taste is the most refreshing meal in the world. Find the punga fruit at your local merchant now, or buy straight from the source at the Duchess Gambit, now docked south of the Citadel. Special bonus. Hey adventurers, itching to find points, uh, point lookout? Treasure, oh, 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 hold up, hold up, that's not the end of a sentence. Looking to find Point Lookout's treasure for yourself? Talk with Tobar to book passage back to this land of mystery. Do we get ferry to cross sea or something? 
Gray walls, impenetrable steel. So, oh, this was the birthday poem. I'm happy to read this. Gray walls, impenetrable steel, suffocation, condemnation, little hands groping in subterranean uncertainty. Mommy, daddy, am I dead? Nay, nay, reborn into purifying fluorescence. A face emerges, strong and male. Father to me, father to all, overseeing our lives, oh, our, our eternities. Harshness of discipline, harshness of love, obedience, my savior. Larva to poopa, larva to poopa. <laughs> <laughs> to worker buzz buzz one with the steel honeycomb ten lies within the 101 significant at last till gray seeps from walls to hair to soul and remember eternal slumber the sweet sleep of incineration you gave that to me on my birthday you're mean what do you want me to do? Get consciousness? Wood chipper? That's not a wood chipper. That's a camera. That is not a what? I guess it's a wood chipper, but it looks like a camera. A mini nuke. Wow. That's our first one. What? I didn't know we'd get a mini nuke. <laughs> Let's see what's up here. Take the rake? No. No. Hunting rifle. Yes. What are we listening to on the ham? Nothing. Okay. Let's continue forward. I believe it's this way. Maybe like right beyond that hill. Who knows? Look, it's Walton Goggins. Oh my god. Is that a bug? You shooting poop at me? Stop that bug. Have zero chance to hit it. <laughs> what about now? When I have the BB gun. Oh, oh the BB gun sucks. Oh, it's so bad. Get one more hit. Oh, don't come back. I thought you were done. I thought you were done. Oh, get wrecked. We're the BB gun warrior. We killed an overseer with this thing. Just had meat. Never too late. Vault shelter. Dang, that's a playground. God, okay, it's gonna follow me too. Stop following me. What is up in here? You discovered Vault 106. Who are those people? Hey, stop beating him! He was getting beat and then he started fighting me! Why would you even do that? You're mean. What happened? I'm sorry. Stop. 
Stop hitting me. I was protecting you, idiot. Stop. Reason with me. Talk to me or something. Were they hitting each other for fun? Yeah, he looks like he'd be hit for fun. Let's go ahead and... Sorry, brain. You're gone. Took out a bad member of society. I'm okay. 32 caliber round. Eh? Nice. 